I was actually in New York City at the time. Um, I was visiting Mary House, which is the last house that my grandmother opened. Uh, it was the house that she spent her last three years and that she died in. They set up the TV in the dining room so everyone could watch it, and um, I was a bit late. So I came rushing in and sat down, and the very first words that I heard out of um, Pope Francis's mouth were, Dorothy Day. And I was so surprised, I practically fell out of my chair. And, um, and people around me said, no, 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 this is, the, this is the fourth time that your grandmother has been mentioned. And I just, I, I couldn't, you know, it was such a surprise. It was such a surprise. I cannot fail to mention the servant of God, Dorothy Day, who founded the Catholic Worker Movement. Her social activism, her passion for justice and for the cause of the oppressed were inspired by the gospel, her faith, and the example of the saints. I'm at a point in my life where I'm so tired of, of the conflicts, of the barriers, of you know, people saying, I'm in, you're out. You know, I'm good, you're not. And unfortunately, that's embedded within the Catholic Church. Um, in many ways, and Pope Francis is really leading us to break down these barriers that my grandmother was breaking down in the 1930s, that um, there is no difference between us all, you know. We are all one family, and uh, so this is incredibly encouraging for me.